Um, could you just give us a, some idea of what a normal day, how you would like to spend a reasonable normal day and working on the investment side of the equation or analysis or reading or just to give us some flavor of that? Thank you. Okay, I'm, I'll, I'll answer the second question first. Very easy. I just, I, I read a lot. Um, and I talk on the telephone a fair amount. We have no meetings. Uh, we have no committees. We have no slide presentations. You know, we have, we have nothing. I mean, it. Um, and uh, so, we, so I, I read a lot. I read annual reports. I read business publications. I could do it in way less time, but I enjoy doing it, so I make it last. I mean, you know, like some other activities in life. The. Uh, so it's it's there's there's really. It, it's the most boring job to anybody watching it, but I'm in love with it, you know, and so I, I, I like doing that, and um, I don't like talking about it a lot. Um, I just I just like to kind of keep up with what's going on. Like I say, by this point in life, I could filter out so much of that, it would, uh, I just don't need to do that much of it, but I, but I, I kind of enjoy just seeing what's going on uh, vicariously through doing a lot of reading, and I spend some time on the phone, and I, I'm on the computer a lot playing bridge, and, and I get to do what I like all the time. At, uh, uh, we'll let Charlie describe what he does, which is even more bizarre. Uh, <laughs> and then we'll talk about compensation and options. <laughs> well, there's a little more foolishness in my life than Warren's, and uh, including being chairman of a large hospital. I, I'm not suggesting that hospitals are foolish. I'm just suggesting that it takes a certain quirk of mind to be willing to be the chairman of a hospital. And uh, so my life is even more, it's less rational than Warren's. Warren lives one of the most rational lives I've ever seen. And uh, it's, it's almost unbelievable. And, and uh, he's got me wondering why I'm here today. 